Welcome to the Webex world, world of high-speed web development with our JavaScript UI library. Let's see what's new in version 9 and 9.1. We completely rewrote Pivot, but the idea of the widget itself remained intact. Webex Pivot currently has simple and flexible customization, three display modes, table, tree, and chart. The new Pivot is three times faster than the previous version and has an extended list of built-in operations and filters. This year, the Webex team has released a new diagram widget and diagram editor that keep becoming more and more functional. This time, we added the ability to rotate blocks in the editor workspace, to move links around the editor workspace. To adjust a block to its content, to retrieve block value and much more. Gantt received a couple of pleasant updates and can now convert dates to the UTC format, define separate working calendars. The set of predefined mass formulas is extended with more than 165 new formulas. Spreadsheet is improved with a couple of minor yet useful updates. Starting from version 9, you can create as many conditions as your project requires. Sharing files in chat widget. Users can now share files with each other as well as download them. Webex is trying to stay in tune with the modern trends and update its form. There are drop down lists with the categories and tags. The tab latest display the most recent activities. The tab top includes the questions with the most numbers of replies. What else can you find in Webex? We've already created more than 100 UI widgets and controls. We've designed complex widgets, file manager, Kanban, spreadsheet, scheduler, pivot table, pivot chart, document manager, query, user manager, chat, Gantt, report manager, and diagram. As a cherry on top, we created Webex Jet, a micro framework that allows you to build a scalable Webex based app of any complexity. There is even more to it Interface UI Designer, a tool for smooth prototyping. Watch our other videos to learn more and follow us on Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter and YouTube.